how are businesses using the science or maybe how should they be using the science? Yeah, well, you know, a lot aren't. So one of our goals is to have businesses look at the data, right? Sometimes that's, that's step one. But even when you get into the A-B testing, for example, you know, you test a different version of the homepage and see which one increases conversions, you should at least have a theory before you do that kind of scientific experiment. And this uh, is a really nice framework for guiding A-B testing. You know, let's, let's use what we already know about the brain rather than just making a guess or you know, whatnot about what version would be better, you know, for the A-B test. So it's a very powerful tool to use and in informing everything that you're doing here. So I, I really don't think a lot are you are using neuromarketing to the, to the full extent. And I really do think it's an important thing for folks to be uh, paying attention to because it can be the difference between an ad campaign that flops or a homepage that, you know, doesn't lead to conversion.